What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Vilma and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys my current straightening hair routine. Now if this is the very first time you're joining me on one of my videos, I have natural curly hair and I'll insert a picture right here so you guys can see. I love my hair. I'm 100% natural love the curls but when the colder months come i really enjoy straightening my hair and i tend to do that quite often um every year so i've been straightening my hair now for the past three weeks since i got back from my holiday i've also dyed my hair darker because i had lighter hair so my hair is a little bit dry on the ends it needs a bit of a trim which i've already done three weeks ago but i'm going to wait till the end of the year but i've been straightening my hair because i just find it easier to maintain throughout the week i don't have to worry if i wash my hair how many hours it's going to take to dry i have a six-year-old which i need to get ready in the morning so by having straight hair it just allows me more time and it's versatile i just love straightening my hair as well now this hair right here which is at the back in a loose ponytail was blown out yesterday i tend to blow out my hair in the evening like on a saturday or sunday and then i allow my hair to just sit and then the following day i straighten my hair i just find that that works a lot better for me because one sometimes there's still moisture in the hair so if you allow your hair to sit for about 10 hours or something like that like overnight you know for sure the following day your hair is completely dry so your straightener is not going to start frying your hair now the products that i'm using are currently pretty new to my collection i've been loving using these new products they're a little bit more on the expensive side so i'm using kerastase and i'm also using l'oreal the mythic oil because i've heard so many good things about it so those are the products that i've been using to achieve at least my blowout but one of the products that i'm going to use right now which is to protect my hair from straightening is the kerastase resistance and this one is called the serum therapist um, i was advised at the hairdresser that i can use about two or three pumps of this and my hair will be kind of like cleopatra style although i try not to put too much over here at the top because i like having a little bit of body as you guys can see i don't like my hair being completely completely flat i like having a little bit of like movement and body so i'm only going to apply this um, kind of like from here to the ends so first i'm going to just part my hair in the middle a little bit more and then i'm just going to use a hair scrunchie put it here so this hair is kind of like out of the way and i'm going to take one pump from this it looks like this is like a cream and oil together i'm going to massage it on my fingers and then just kind of like apply it right here this product smells amazing like all the kerastase products i'm using smell absolutely divine so the rest that i have i'm just going to apply it a little bit at the top just to protect my hair but the heaviness of the product will be more concentrated at the bottom to straighten my hair i'm going to use my um, ghd straighteners i've had these for years i would say maybe six years or so these are the larger plates as you guys can see so i'm going to switch that on um, these are the best straighteners i've ever used for my hair because they reach just the right temperature to straighten my hair without causing that much of damage if that makes sense because straightening your hair will always cause a little bit of damage but these are the best straighteners i've ever used to help my hair smooth out i'm going to use two brushes i'm going to use my denman brush and just a head jog um, round brush it just helps to hold the hair and stuff like that so i'm just waiting for my straightener to warm up there you go it's warm now so what i'm going to do is just take a section right at the back and because i have really thick hair i have to take um slightly smaller sections or else my hair will not look straight at all so what i tend to do is just brush my hair a little bit to take all the knots out then i hold my hair like this and i start straightening it just like this and don't worry this 
the smoke that you're seeing is from the serum that I've just applied. So as you can see, my hair is totally straight. I don't feel like I need to go back. These parts, uh, the bottom part of my hair is so soft. There's no split ends that I don't feel like I need to constantly go back with the straightener. So I'm just going to speed this section now or else we're going to be here forever. It takes me about 20 minutes to half an hour to straighten my full head. As you can see on this side is nice and sleek and it's shiny and everything this side is just a little bit more poofy and it needs taming um, but it's not completely flat like flat to my head because I don't like it what I tend to do is put my hair behind my ears because then it will create kind of like a natural kind of like curve or wave at the front which I really enjoy and I'm gonna start doing my right side so I'm going to pump one pump of this product, massage it into my hands and apply it again at the ends. My hair on this side is a lot more dry than it is on the left for some reason. But I guess it was just the bleach that I used this summer. It really damaged my hair. Um, but yeah. So again, I'm going to start with a smaller section at the back. It took me about 10 minutes to do the other side. Not even, I don't even think it took me 10 minutes. Now the right side of my head, for some reason, is the most awkward side for me to do my hair. So I'll probably struggle a little bit trying to do this on camera. So just bear with me, guys. And again, the smoke that you're seeing is the serum, okay? It's not my hair frying or anything like that. Um, I like to take care of my hair and not um, do my hair when it's wet. And this serum is a hair protector. I'll put all the links in the info bar below for you guys.
So here you have my hair finished and I love how it feels. It still has a lot of movement as you guys can see. It's not glued to my scalp, which I absolutely hate. And I don't like applying like root lifters or mousse because it's going to make my hair so dirty and I have to wash it maybe two or three days after. So to finish off, because my hair um, already looks pretty good, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Mythic Oil. Um, I bought this yesterday and I love it. I'm just going to use one pump. This is kind of like a very light oil just to give you a little bit of finish on the ends and nourishment from all that heat that we put the hair through. And then whatever I have left, I just apply it on the top of my hair. I love applying serums and oils and stuff like that, but I don't like anything heavy whatsoever. So that is it for my current straightening hair routine. I do hope that you guys found this video helpful, that you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried these products, what you think about them. If there's any other Kerastase products that you would recommend because I'm really enjoying the two separate lines that I'm using. I will be doing a separate review on both lines. If you're not following me on Instagram, please do so because I always post pictures of new products that I'm trying or anything new that I have. So thank you so much for joining me. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you on my next one.